Well, good morning and uh, welcome to yet another uh, Advent reading. And today's reading is going to come uh, from the Gospel of Matthew, uh, chapter 21, beginning at verse 23 through 27. So I invite you to hear uh, these words this morning. Jesus entered the temple courts, and while he was teaching, the, the chief priest and the elders of the people came to him. By what authority are you doing these things, these things being the miracles and the teachings and, and the challenging of people to live their life differently? And who gave you this authority? Jesus replied, I will ask you one question. If you answer me, I will tell you by what authority I am doing these things. John's baptism, where did it come from? Was it from heaven or was it from human origin? They discussed it amongst themselves and said, If we say from heaven, he will ask, then why didn't you believe him? But if we say of, of human origin, we are afraid of the people, for they all hold that John was a prophet. And so they answered Jesus, we don't know. Then he said, neither will I tell you by what authority I am doing these things. My friends, this is the word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. This morning, we are challenged in the text to hear this, this call of by what authority and every time I come across this text, I'm so reminded of, of when the bishop in the cabinet to, uh, lay hands upon me and said, "By take now the authority to go and to preach and to proclaim the good news and, and to administer the sacraments. Jesus, if we look at this text, we notice at least four times the word authority uh, is mentioned. And it's to highlight this, co this continual battle, this this engagement that happens between Jesus, the religious leaders, and even the people. They, they want to know by what authority. This morning, as you go back and read this text and, 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 and really reflect on it, I invite you to consider the question, does God have authority in your life? Has the battle over by what authority uh, been answered? Or are you still caught up in the battle of trying to be self-reliant and self-independent? Um, I invite you to reflect this morning as we continue to prepare our hearts and our minds during the season of Advent. Uh, have I truly surrendered and allowed God to have authority of my life? Jesus, may that be true. Help us to be a people who are able to recognize you as the authority of our lives. We pray this in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Friends, it's been good to be with you again yet uh, this morning, and uh, I pray God's blessings upon you, and may you be a blessing to others as you answer the call to have Jesus the authority of your life. Take care.